So the head coach for the UNCW women's soccer team has been placed on administrative leave with pay. WWAY Sports Director Dustin Dorsey has been investigating this story and working on it all night and joins us now with the latest. So Dustin, what have you learned? Well, Amanda, Coach Paul Kearney has been with the UNCW women's soccer team since 1994. But we learned today that he's been on administrative leave since early December. We found tweets posted last summer and more in November and December after the Me Too movement started accusing Coach Kearney of sexual misconduct at a UNCW soccer camp. Two days after the most recent tweet, the school placed him on administrative leave. It is unclear at this time if it was a response to these tweets. Now we reached out to UNCW spokeswoman Janine Iamuno and she released a statement saying in part, the university is aware of the allegations against Coach Kearney and she goes on to say he was placed on leave in order to, for the university to conduct a personal inquiry. Now Iamuno says this is not a dis disciplinary action but adds anyone with information about the matter should contact the university. We also reached out to Coach Kearney's attorney, Bruce Mason, who responded to the allegations tonight, saying, quote, the allegation against Coach Paul Kearney is false. The accusation alleges an incident occurring in 1994. This claim was fully and thoroughly investigated by the New Hanover County Sheriff's Department in 2007. Paul cooperated in that investigation. The Quote continues as saying UNCW is required to take seriously all allegations of this nature and Coach Kearney is fully cooperating with the process and will continue to do so until its completion. Paul is very grateful for the outpouring of support from his family and friends, end quote. We also spoke with Lieutenant Jerry Brewer of the New Hanover County Sheriff's Office about that investigation from 2007. He said they are working on getting information about the case and we will have that information right here tomorrow.